You have TK Kirkland also being 50 Cent. And I'd like to thank Aaron in the comment section for giving me this tip. As when I did the Jamatria, there was a connection there as well. Nothing is new under the sun. These characters been doing this for the fence the longest. They can transfer their souls from one body to the next. They can trick our eyes. You know, I'm using CGI, prosthetics, and makeup. Certain things that they do in order to get energy from the people. This world is a stage. Layers upon layers of deception. They've been do doing this in the movies, the TV shows we watch, and the video games. They show us the truth hidden in plain sight. The things that you see on TV, they do in real life too. Like, say for instance, The Matrix. It has a lot, a lot of hidden truths in that movie. Where it says, the people of this world, of this world, we we're all the slaves to the system that's set in place. All these celebrities that you see, all a part of it, all a part of the agenda. They're immortal. And I can see a resemblance as well. When I look at 50 Cent and T.K. Kirkland, when you look at them closely, I know you you all may think I'm crazy or going crazy, something is wrong with me, but I promise you that I'm on to something when it comes to this stuff. I know one thing for sure, that all these celebrities are connected and related to each other in some form or fashion. All of them are Freemasons, sworn to secrecy. But they hide the truth in plain sight. As they say, Hollywood is a family business. Everybody in there knows each other. Nothing is new under the sun. All the events that you see on TV, all the quote-unquote catastrophes, all of it is staged. Staged to collect energy from the public. I don't know how long they've been doing this, probably since the beginning of time. But when I looked up T.K. Kirkland's birthday, he was born in April. That's about a two-month difference. And these characters will always be born a couple months apart. And when I looked up 50 Cent's birthday, he was born in July, every single time. Now, when I typed in Curtis in the Jamarchinator, which is 50 Cent's first name, I got 32 in Jewish reduction. And when I typed in T.K. Kirkland, I got 32 in Jewish reduction as well. Now, this is in the same cipher, so you know it's a definite match. Now, when I looked up the Curtis again, you get 32 in Septenary. The numbers don't lie, y'all.